Hey guys, so I am currently in my new car. I'm so excited. I just had to start the uh, video off by telling you that so you know where I am. But yes, I got a new car finally. We are going to put in the baby seat. I'm so excited. But um, I wanted to make a quick trip to my mall uh, before I have to go to work in like an hour and a half. Uh, luckily, my new debit card just came in the mail, so I got to activate that before I go. But I'm heading to the mall with a few things in mind. Um, <sighs> sorry, I was just trying to think. Um, the video before this one should have been up by now um was my like Maybelline uh, I'm sorry wet and wild um uh lipstick review so that's kind of been motivating me to go find more lip color I actually have a little bit of that lip color on I just kind of very lightly put it on so it wasn't such an intense color um but it's kind of motivated me to go try some of the matte colors I've seen I really want to give them um a try and see how I like them so I'm heading over to my um uh, mall I'm looking for MAC um lipsticks i'm also looking for a pair of nude shoes with like a point um but that are reasonably high with high heels because i use i usually go to charlotte ruse for my heels but sometimes those are more like club wear unless you get like the boots or something but they don't have like smaller heels so um i'm probably gonna go to payless which i actually get pretty lucky with payless sometimes um so I'm going to get those and then I want to stop at my Sephora and see if they have that better than sex mascara. I really want to try it. So um, <laughs> I would probably just go and do all that, make the trip to the mall real quick and then come back with you guys and show you if I was successful at getting all those items or not. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, so this is like the worst spot ever for my camera, but um, I needed two hands to show you guys what I got. And I was actually just gonna, I just pulled back into my house. I was gonna show you guys what I got in the mall parking lot, but the parking lot is like under those like roof type of things. So it was really, really dark. So I'm like, all right, I'll just wait until I pull back home so we have some lighting. Um, but I found, I think everything I needed. I think I went there for lipstick, shoes, and better than sex, right? Yeah, okay, I got everything, plus a little bit more because I'm a shopaholic. <laughs> um, no, I really didn't do bad, but I'll show you guys what I got. So the first thing, I went to Sephora first, and I got the, what I went there for, I got the better than sex mascara, and I've heard so much about this. I think it was like $23. So it's a little bit on like the pricier side for mascara, but I'm like, if it really works wonders the way it says it does, then it might be worth it. So that's what the packaging looks like. And I'm definitely going to be doing like a product review of this. Um, it's not like super expensive that you can't get it, but if you is a little bit of a splurge, I think, um, it shows on the brush that the brush is like an hourglass. So I don't know, maybe I'll record a, um, a product review tomorrow morning when I do my makeup because I really really want to try it um, and then just have that video up uh, be up sometime this week because I definitely need to get a pregnancy diaries out today so I don't know when you'll see this you'll see this before this but it might be like the um, wet and wild lipstick review and then my pregnancy diaries and then this and then this so <laughs> I have like four videos lined up so it might be a while until um, I review this but I'm probably gonna record it tomorrow um, and then I went to Payless they didn't have what I was looking for which is fine it's always a hit and a miss um, but then I went to CVS because I wanted to pick up some more eyelashes and I'm going more for the wispy ones now and I'm actually gonna put these ones on on top of my eyelashes I have now and these are 113s in Ardell but weirdly enough these are also 113s in Ardell but do you see the difference like one is a little bit wispier than the other like this one's wispier so I don't really know I'm just gonna have to pay attention every time I go there but I'm probably gonna put on the wispier ones just to give myself a little bit more length I guess than um than volume so that's all I got from CVS and then like I said I didn't find the shoes I wanted at Payless so I stopped in um Forever 21 not looking for shoes but I was just like hmm, they might have something cute and I actually found the shoes that I was looking for there in two different colors <laughs> so the first color is the color I originally wanted and I got these in eight and a half so this is what I was talking about they are like well they are the 
shinier one i could have gone for matte or shiny but they happen to have the shiny so these are the ones that i'm talking about they still have the heel but it's not like crazy pump heel and they don't have that platform so this is definitely more of a casual look and um on top of these i actually found the black ones first and I was like oh my gosh those are the exact shoes I want just in black so I picked these up too and I figured I could wear these daily or I could wear them out um, if I'm wearing them daily I figured again they could dress up a very casual outfit because they are shinier so like I said I would have gone for matte or shiny it just happened that they had shiny both of them are eight and a half because my feet have swelled up <coughs> because of the um, pregnancy and such so I used to be an eight so I went up a little bit and then I was actually debating, there you are, I was debating on going into Macy's to look for a matte lipstick, <clears throat> a MAC lipstick, but I was like, hey, why not? So I ended up picking up the color, um, where was it? Cream in your coffee. So it's kind of like a nudie color. But I was doing some swatches <clears throat> on my hand, and that's kind of why it looks dirty there. Um, but this looks like the best. It's like more of a brown-ish color. So I'm going to put this on and see how I even like it. I didn't try it on the store. Like I said, I just swatched it. So that's the color. I thought it was really pretty. So I don't know if you can really tell. I really like the color. I just think with lipsticks, I'll give you a close up. I just think with lipstick, I don't like <clears throat> a ton of pigmentation, and that might sound weird. I like the more like toned down look. So let me see if I can kind of wipe this off a little bit and see how I like it. Just a little bit. See the color still there. It's just not as bright. Hmm. Well now the the bottom is a little more. I need mm, trying to. <laughs> uh, so what if I was just to kind of dab it? Yeah, honestly, I think I like it better when I just dabbed it. But I think I, I chose a good color. Um, I like it. I'm going to use it for uh, now and for fall and pretty much all year round because I don't care. I like the color. But I am sweating, so I am going to go, guys. I'm going to put this stuff away. So um, <clears throat> whatever you see this, I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a thumbs up if you did. Um, you can also subscribe if you don't want to miss any new videos. Also, my Twitter link is on my channel page. It's automatically updated every time I upload a video. And my Instagram link is down below if you want to follow me down there. But again, thank you so much for watching. Bye.